I feel like we're all over the board that some of those things for some people happen really fast, you know, others they take a long time. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. This yeah, is and, tough and the tough thing is, I mean, any one of these could be correct, yeah. so to speak. Right. All right, well, I guess we'll find out. Now, I understand uh, you have some goodies down there. Is I that the do, case? which makes me think we should see you in just a moment. Well, you can pretty much count on that. Okay, all right, we'll see you in just a second then. <laughs> see you in a bit. Well, the view from Pike Place Market is, of course, already beautiful, but how about adding a delicious meal during sunset? Here today is the group putting on the Sunset Supper this Friday. Chef Gavin Stevenson is doing the cooking. Glenn Sil... Sil Sivertson. Sivertson. I knew I would get that wrong. I'm so sorry. From Will Ridge Winery has the wine pairings covered. And Patricia Gray from the Pike Place Foundation. Great to have all of you here. Thank, Thank you. you. Uh, great to see you. Patricia, why don't you start off just by telling us about this event, who it benefits. Right. So Sunset Supper, it is really the party of the summer in Seattle. We turn over the market uh, from the farmers and the artists. They move out and we have a hundred of the region's top chefs, wineries, breweries and distilleries set up for an amazing magical evening. So fun. I mean, what a great location and yeah. wonderful food and wonderful wine. Uh, right. Boy, you really can't go wrong. And as you saw, we've got great weather coming up for it as well. That's a plus. Uh, Chef, tell us a little bit about what you'll be making. Okay, great. Well, I'm going to make, uh, well, we know it's going to be really, really warm. So right. I'm going to make a snow cone. Okay. And I'm going to make snow cones with honey vodka from the honey from the ape area on the top of our hotel and oh, then wow. uh, a local product which is uh, mussels from uh, Penn Cove which uh, Raul Jeffers uh, provided the mussels for us yeah and we pickled them and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna make little snow cones um, I'm just gonna finish them off real quick and then it's, it sounds kind of a little bit different. It's kind of like right. a bloody Caesar. Yeah, I keep thinking, know? okay, where's Steve? Oh, good, Steve, you're yeah, here, for, you're here for the um, muscle snow cone. That's right. So, Excuse me? Yes, that's what I said. <laughs> right. A muscle snow cone. So it's going to be close to 90 degrees, right? Right. So, and there's a 1,600 people roughly going to be there, Tricia. Right. So, you know, you're going to have to wait in line to, to get your different food and bites. Right. And I thought, well, what better way than to give them a little alcohol, a little shellfish <laughs> at the same time. This is some honey vodka. So this honey is honey vodka. vodka yeah. That's going to go over. From his to, own bees. Yeah, it's that's amazing. It's kind of making yeah. like a little drink. Really? And then I, you have to have a lot of honey, so we're going to put a little <laughs> honey on okay. there. Okay. And then it's kind of like a play on a, on a Bloody Caesar. This is a pickled Which mussel. Which I do like those. That I'm going to put right on the top. Okay. And then flowers, because the market's all about flowers, right? So we put a little flowers on the top, and then a chorizo chip. Okay. So. Okay. That's pretty fabulous. Okay. Um, here we go. Okay. <laughs> all right. Do you then. want a... So how, should he have a spoon? Yeah, you so can just, spoon, like, throw that can, back. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. There you yeah. go. I don't want to wear it. You know, it. while you, it. while you're having that, I okay. wanted to talk to Glenn about the wine pairing. So tell me a little bit about what you're doing. So um, I brought two wines with us. This is uh, uh, Rachel Red and Billy Blanc are two wines that we produce to benefit wow. the Pike Place Market Foundation. Wonderful. So for wow. sales of every bottle, um, it benefits wow. the foundation and all the good work that they do with the, the daycare and the senior center and the um, clinic and all that stuff. Right. Um, we are Seattle's oldest winery. We've been in business in 20, for 28 years up in Madrona, and we're trying to be the greenest winery in the state as well. Oh, really? Time. Yep. Wow. Should, should Steve have some Will Ridge wine with his uh, yes. muscle snow cone? That, that would work. I'm, look, I'm looking out for you, pal. Okay, thank you, dear. <laughs> no, this is, I, I did not expect it. It's great. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. It was an interesting pairing of Yeah, there, yeah, I wouldn't yeah. have thought that. Oh, go ahead. It's uh, Shannon Blanc from... Uh, Patricia, real quickly, there's a contest for our viewers, too. I don't want to get miss Absolutely. out on people knowing how they can win some Absolutely. tickets. Absolutely. So tickets are still available at pikeplacemarketfoundation.org. But for Como viewers, we are going to offer two free tickets to the event. Just go to the Pike Place Market Foundation Facebook page. Okay. Post a picture of you in the market. Oh, And great tell idea. us why you lo love Pike Place. Um, we'll pick the winner on Wednesday and announce it here um, at 4 p.m. Wonderful. Great. great. Thank you all for coming yeah. in. Yeah. This yeah. is incredible. It'll be such a fun event, too. Mm. For more information, you can go to our website, comonews.com. Yeah, it's tasty. Coming up on First News.